I'm Stephanie Hayden. And I'm Kaylee Alatori. And you're watching Channel News. The announcements for today are GCMS Blood Drive will be held from four, April 14th from 2 to 6. If you are interested in being a donor, please contact Carrie Davis in the office for an appointment. Middle school basketball players may turn in their apparel order forms into the office. Discount car sales will end this on March 31st. <laughs> if you have already sold some cards, bring forms to Miss Locker in the morning and she will try to get the cards for you to deliver by the end of the day. Now to Jacob with the weather. Okay, my head's completely uh just Oh my exploded. gosh, Jacob, you're invisible. Take my card again. Okay. <laughs> okay. That's this is kind of awkward, but oh my God, you I look guess like since such a pretty princess. I guess <laughs> since I'm not floating no more, it's I'll crazy. just. That's that's lovely. That's just that's flattering on your. All right, let's do the weather. Let's get to the weather part. All right, <laughs> uh, we're gonna see actually warmer temperatures than we did yesterday, and we're gonna get, be getting up to this is so weird, 74 <laughs> degrees, a low of 47 degrees, probably mostly sunny skies. There might be a few clouds here and there. Tonight we do see uh, partly cloudy skies, maybe a 10% chance of an evening rain shower, but that is again 10%, so probably a least likely chance of it happening. All right, so get out there and enjoy the beautiful weather. Let's go to Nicholas with your sports. Nicholas Kendall for another sports update. Cleveland Cavaliers all-star Kyrie Irving left his superstar teammate LeBron James in awe. His spectacular play overwhelmed the San Antonio Spurs. The guard collected a career high and NBA season high 57 points and his fadeaway three sent the emotional game into overtime where Cleveland rallied for a 128-125 victory over the defending NBA champion Spurs on Thursday night. The Milwaukee Brewers will have to find a new way to celebrate for the next few spring training games. The team has banned high fives to avoid the spread of pink eye. I know it's weird. Uh, ew. Ew. A weekend soccer player in Detroit, in, in the Detroit area whose punch killed a referee has been sentenced to at least eight years in prison for involuntary manslaughter. The case against Bas Basel Saad ha has put a spotlight on out of control recreational athletes and inspired Michigan lawmakers to consider to consider new crimes for assaults on sports referees. Monte Harris scored 24 points for the for the for the Iowa State Cyclones and hit the game-winning shot at the buzzer to beat the long to beat the Texas Longhorns 69-67. This has been Nicholas Kendall with your sports. Thanks, guys. So today is hot wings and tater time. Lunch for tomorrow is beef or chicken taco. Tacos. Mexican food. Mexican food is bay over here. Is very excited. It's birthday time! Happy birthday to Brittany Harrison, Cheyenne Tabor, Cheyenne Tabor, <laughs> Dakota Spangler, and our very own Nicholas Kendall. Happy birthday, Nicholas! Happy birthday, Kendall. You're officially 14! Woot. Yeah, but you're uglier. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Thanks for watching Talent News. I'm Stephanie Hayden. And I'm Kaylee Alatori. No. Eagle. Have a great day. Nick